All right, hey collective, I'm back on here to come give you guys a general spread for today. Remember the spread that I'm pulling for you is timeless, it's also general. So I need for you guys to only accept the message if it's for you. If it's not, leave it for the next person. Also, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. If you haven't already, come join me so we can grow the energy over here for you guys, all right? So we're gonna tap into this energy. I also need for you guys to please tap into your intuition, only receive the message if it's for you, all right? So the first card of flaw is we have the ancestors that are so proud of you, all right? We have the overcame emotional instability. So I definitely feel like for a lot of guys, a lot of you guys, you overcame something. All right. For a lot of you guys, it has something to do with some form of trauma that you have overcame or you healed from. Okay. Just know your ancestors are proud of you. All right. We have the chosen one card of flaw here. And look, we have the divine feminine. So you can definitely be a chosen individual. You can be a divine feminine or divine masculine that overcame something. Okay. I feel like whatever this is was kind of hard for you guys to overcome it, but you did. Okay. Just know your ancestors ancestors are proud of you, all right? We have the finding balance. It's something about you guys finding some form of balance after you overcame something, okay? You could be seeing angel number 333 a lot, all right? But it's something about you guys becoming more balanced after overcoming some form of trauma, okay? All right? For a lot of you guys, look, we have the spiritual inheritance, and look here, we have the coming in. So, by a lot of you guys, by you overcoming or healing something, definitely brought in some type of spiritual inheritance. For a lot of you guys, your gifts are about to be definitely elevated, okay? Because you overcame something that had something to deal with your emotions, okay? All right? So make sure you guys are doing some form of cleansing, all right? Because you got a new beginning coming in, okay? It came out here twice, all right? So for a lot of you guys, make sure you guys are doing your spiritual cleansing, all right, make sure you guys are cleaning out, cleansing out your energy, all right, because a new beginning is about to happen for you guys. You could be seeing angel number 222 a lot, all right? So after overcoming something difficult, okay, for a lot of you guys, this is what I want to say. You have this new beginning coming in, all right? Um, we have the tower, though. Someone is going through a tower moment, though. Someone is going through a tower that you got this new beginning, all right? Or something is about to start for you, all right? We have the celebrating life. So for a lot of you guys, whatever this new beginning is, I feel like you guys are about to be celebrating or being celebrated, okay? Um, and someone is going through a tower right now. Um, someone did not expect you to get to this new beginning, all right? Um, so this person is kind of upset right now. This person could definitely be, um, like I said, in their feelings or going through a tower. Because for a lot of you guys, someone did not expect you to overcome some form of trauma, okay? This could be an older water sign for a lot of you guys, a Cancer Scorpio Pisces, all right? Um, that definitely could have been trying to put you through some type of spiritual warfare, okay? We have the confusion, and look here, we have the health. So whoever this older water sign that's going through a tower right now, I feel like this person definitely is upset that something backfired. Someone did not want you to overcome something. So I feel like whoever this is has been putting up some form of confusion, some form of illusions. And for a lot of you guys, it was meant to attack your health. I'm hearing your mental health, okay? This is someone who did not want you to overcome something emotionally, but you did, okay? All right? So this person is definitely going through a tower right now. We also have the month of November that flew out here. So I don't know if some of you guys could definitely been going through some form of heavy spiritual warfare in the month of November, okay? But a lot of you guys, this could have been this person who has been trying to stop you from overcoming something, okay? All right? So make sure you guys are cleansing out your energy. Flew out here again. Consistently cleanse out your energy, all right? Make sure you guys are doing your meditation because I feel like whoever this is is definitely projecting some type of energy towards you right now and that's because something backfired okay so make sure you guys are cleansing out your energies make sure you guys are meditating because you got a DNA upgrade coming in okay you're being activated right now all right someone tried to stop this all right someone tried to stop you from growing spiritually all right so make sure you guys are like i said cleansing out your energy because you're being activated you're definitely being upgraded all right for a lot of you guys it has a lot to do with your spiritual growth okay all right also this is why i feel like someone's going through a tower someone did not expect you to grow so much it's what i'm picking up for a lot of you guys all right it's something about your spiritual growth also all right. We have the remain balanced card that flew out here that flew out again. OK, so something about you guys continue remaining balanced. OK, make sure you guys are meditating. All right. Um, just know that you have a lot of divine protection around you. For a lot of you guys, this is Archangel Michael that's protecting you. And whatever this new beginning is, OK, four, four, four on the clock, you're protected. All right. So make sure you guys are, make sure, uh, like I said, cleansing out your energy. 
because you got some form of new cycle that's definitely about to start for you guys. And for a lot of you guys, this has something to do with your gifts. All right. Um, so some additional messages that came out for here for you guys is we have the gifted card that flew out here. So for a lot of you guys, you're definitely about to be gifted something. Now, this could be some form of spiritual inheritance. I'm also hearing for a lot of you guys, this could be something monetary because you overcame something. All right. Uh, we have your ancestors love you. OK, so just know your ancestors love you. OK, for getting over something that was difficult. All right. And we have the keep moving forward card. So something about you guys continue moving forward, continue moving forward on your healing. All right. For a lot of you guys. All right. Something definitely is new, new that's about to start for you guys. OK. All right. So we're going to pull you guys a clarifying card. OK. For you guys. All right. You definitely got a new beginning, okay? Because I feel like whatever this was for a lot of you guys, it says wisdom of the divine feminine, okay? So you definitely could be a divine feminine. And for a lot of you guys, it's something to do with your spiritual growth, okay? You're definitely being upgraded, all right? So you can definitely be a divine feminine. This is wisdom of the divine feminine. It says trust in the plan, okay? All right, number 13 out here. All right, so something about you guys, continue trusting in what's going on, okay, uh, for a lot of you guys, because you did overcome something, all right? Something new is starting for you guys, okay? Um, it's something about you guys, continue trusting in whatever it is that you're doing. Keep moving forward on whatever this is. And like I said, if I'm picking up a lot of you guys, you're healing, okay? All right, keep trusting in whatever it is that's happening right now, okay? Ooh. Look, we have hold your center, okay? Stay balanced, okay? Because something definitely new is about to start for you guys, okay? Um, so something about you guys, like I said, remain in balance. We have the star child card of flaw here. So some of you guys could be some form of star seed, okay? You could be a divine feminine that's a star seed, all right? But just know something's about to start, okay? Um... And something about you guys staying balanced, all right, um, for a lot of you guys. So we're going to pull, let's see what else we can get out here, okay? I feel like for a lot of you guys, um, look, we have the play card. It says, have fun, celebrate, don't be so serious, okay? So something about you guys, definitely go out and have fun. You're being protected. Whatever this is, is being protected, okay? Um, you're definitely going to be celebrated, okay? Um, I feel like your ancestors don't want you to get out and enjoy life, okay? Um, something is over with. You overcame something. So it's now for you, time for you guys to be happy, all right? It's your time to be happy, all right? Um, something about you guys going, look, we have the protection. You are being protected. It says call back your power, cut the cords. You got a soul retrieval, okay? All right, something's being renewed also, all right? You're being protected, okay? Let's see if we can get any more. All right. I feel like your ancestors are protecting you. Your angels are protecting you right now, okay? <clears throat> we have the star mother, okay? It says, um, how can you mother yourself? Something about some form of self-care is what I'm getting from that card. Okay, something about you guys taking some time out for self-care, taking some time out for fun, because for a lot of you guys, you overcame something, okay? Something's over with, all right? Um, and I feel like your ancestors are wanting you to get out and have, you know, have some fun, okay? That's what I'm picking up from this spread here, all right? Something about you guys taking time out for yourself, Okay? All right, because you had some of you guys definitely went through like a difficult cycle, whatever this thing that you overcame, it was difficult. OK, so this new beginning that's starting for you guys is going to be I'm here for a lot of you guys. It's going to be peaceful. It's going to be easy. All right. You're going to be able to enjoy having fun. OK, or enjoying life. OK, celebrating life. All right. Because it's something about to have fun and celebrate. OK. All right, so um, let's see. We're going to give you guys a, um, we got, uh, all right. 
And when I pick up this deck, it says I am expanding. So for a lot of you guys, it's something about you definitely about to expand, all right? Whatever this DNA upgrade that you guys are about to receive, it's definitely something about you expanding, all right? I'm picking up spiritually for a lot of you guys, all right? All right, what's this I am expanding? Look, it's another center card, okay? Um, it says 666, six, six, I am centered. It says a wake-up call for you to re-examine your current situation and change the direction of your thoughts so you can raise your vibration to a more positive frequency, frequency okay? So it's something about you guys. Like I said, this card said, have fun, celebrate, don't be so serious, all right? It's something about you guys staying centered, okay? Raise up your vibration for a lot of you guys because I feel like whatever this is that you overcame, definitely... <clears throat> Something about you guys need to raise up your vibration. It could have put you in some type of uh, low vibration. So raise up your vibration. All right. Um, definitely put you in some form of positive frequency. Okay. What else? Oof. Look, we have I am wealthy. All right. It says you are on the cusp of a prosperous and abundant spiritual life, okay? So, this definitely has something to do with your spiritual gifts, all right? Um, whatever this upgrade is, it's going to bring in a lot of wealth for you guys, okay? A lot of prosperity. It says you will find numerous opportunities for success and achievement, okay? A lot of new doors about to open up for you. A lot of new opportunities, all right? It says all of which bring financial and material abundance in your life, okay? So, for a lot of you guys, whatever this is, you're definitely about to be celebrating, okay? I feel like since you overcame something, it's a lot of new doors. A lot of new opportunities are about to present themselves to you, okay? And all these opportunities and these new doors is going to bring in some type, some type of financial or material abundance in your life, okay? All right? You're very, you're very much so going to be prosperous, all right? Abundant, all right? You're on the cusp of something, okay? I feel like for a lot of you guys, there's something about you guys raising up your vibrations right now, okay? We have I am optimistic. It says a major shift is about to come into your into your life experience and change your path direction. Be open and stay positive. Okay, so something's gonna change for you guys. Okay. And I feel like whatever this new beginning is, it's gonna for a lot of you guys require some form of change. Is what I'm picking up. It's something about you guys staying optimistic, okay? Because it's a major shift is coming in since you definitely, like I said, overcame some form of trauma, is what I'm picking up for some of you guys. All right. It's a major shift that's about to happen, and it's going to be a new beginning, all right? So don't fear the change that's coming in. I want to tell some of you guys, all right? It is some form of change coming in, all right? I feel like your ancestors are wanting you to stay optimistic, okay? And stay positive about whatever's changing right now, okay? All right? For a lot of you guys. So um, we're going to pull out some zodiacs. I want to see what zodiac signs could relate to this spread, okay? see we have fire sign aries leo sag we have aries okay so you can definitely be a fire sign specifically at aries all right all right we have the sun card so for a lot of you guys this could be some form of change of career all right we have capricorn that flew out here so for a lot of you guys this could be like some form of change of career for a lot of you guys okay so this change, this major shift could be some form of change in career, okay? We have an Aquarius that flew out here, could be significant. We have Aries again. So a lot of you guys could definitely be an Aries, okay? Let's see. We're going to get one more. We have Virgo out here, okay? So you could be a Virgo. We also have Scorpio that flew over, all right? Could be significant here. All right, but something definitely is changing for you guys. All right, you have overcame a lot, and I feel like for a lot of you guys, your ancestors are proud of you. It's some form of new door, new opportunity that's about to open up for you. Okay, um, we have the number 26, we have 13, we have the number 1, 11, we have one again, so that's 11, 11 up here. We have 6, 10, and we have 8 out here. Okay, all right, so um, 
just know, like I said, your ancestors are proud of you. You overcame something. This new beginning is happening. For a lot of you guys, it has something to do with you being upgraded spiritually. All right. Um, and whatever this change is, I feel like your ancestors are wanting you to accept it. Okay. Stay balanced. All right. You're being protected. All right. It's something about you guys celebrate life or go out and celebrate or something that's coming in. It's going to allow you to celebrate. All right. Or be celebrated. All right. So that's what I have for you collective. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my channel. I will speak with you guys in a minute and I love y'all so much. Bye.